it's not snowing in LA. Mm, mm, mm -hmm. That's him right there. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my god. Here is the camera that we're gonna be using for the reel. That it's red, not only that it's LV, but the fact that this is Pharrell's collab. It looks so cute in my outfit. That's so cool. Good morning, happy Wednesday. The priority today, I am shooting my Boohoo Men post for tomorrow. So I'm gonna knock that out today. Currently, I am getting ready. I just wanna say I am so happy right now because my vanity is so clean. I have not seen my drawers like this so organized in a very long time. And I just wanna give a big shout out to my men for actually putting this together for me. Cause for the past few months, literally half the year, last year, we have been traveling and I've been so exhausted. That I just been constantly working that my whole entire room just got messy I am gonna show you guys what it looks like it's pretty insane look how organized this is new brushes right there I got my lashes just wanna give a big shout out to Lily Lashes love them I got my MAC and my NYX lip liners I got my mascara I got my eyeliners my duo my jewelry in here look at this thing he did an amazing job cleaning that up and I don't know how he decided to do that and I don't know why he decided to do that but I can't get mad at it and we quickly find odds between capitalism and staying true to our creativity whatever he's talking about I'm here for it even though I to you now it is time to fix my hair Look how flat this one is I have my clothes rack here full of Boohoo Men fits I have my outfit laid down already This is my fit I wanted to show you guys what this jacket looks like I am in love with the detail This is why I fell in love with this one When I saw this online, I was like, oh, this kind of matched my Louis Since it's winter time, it's all about being cozy I love wearing my sweats it's very minimal with my accessories i got my lv bag right here this is what i'm going to be using for the accessories i'm probably going to be using gold jewelry for this one and then i got my hose mat beanie because we want like a little pop of color and with the boots i have an excuse to wear my winter boots from louis it's not snowing in la but we are going to pretend that it's winter time i'm gonna put this on real quick So it looks like this, right? So what I'm gonna do is tuck it in in the back, just like that. It's cool because it comes with a hood, just in case it does start raining outside. Okay, that's the outfit. So I'm gonna be using this one. I like to spray a lot. I like to feel like I'm actually going out, which I am because I am gonna be shooting outside and probably gonna do some errands, get myself some coffee because I'm running out. One thing about my perfume that I use, I do have a little travel size. So that means I can go out and then if I'm feeling sweating, grimy, and I'm just out all day, then I have my perfume right here. Here's my outfit. Love it. Here's my photo inspo. So you can go ahead and check out and see which one that aligns with this fit. I was gonna say, I like this sunset vibe. This is basically how it goes down when it comes to treating my content. I show him my photo inspo and then him as a creative director, photographer, he'll make it happen. Producer. The producer. What do you think about my outfit? Rate it one out of 10. I love it. Looks like about to go snowboarding. I have to make sure I have everything. Got my tripod. This is the best tripod in the whole entire world. And I got my little GoPro. We are now in the car. I really hope that it doesn't rain on us. I hope that we can shoot very efficient and quick. And we haven't eaten anything yet. It's 1 p.m. So we're probably gonna stop by and get some food. So we figure out what to eat. We're gonna get some dim sum real quick at this favorite spot that we normally go to for whenever we're craving them some on the go. This is the one in Hollywood. Dumpling, do one veggie spring roll. We normally come here, right? And then the guy that works at the ballet at the parking lot, he loves talking to us, he loves talking to Dante. And this is actually my first time finally talking to him and having this conversation. And his energy and just overall, like the way he speaks, the way he talks about everything in life. I don't know if that's God talking to me or that's just like the universe talking to me. It makes me happy that knowing that there's other people who are basically like us who thinks 
the same thing, who has the same energy that we have. We were talking for like at least 30 minutes. I'm going to show you guys everything that we got. Shrimp tempura, veggie dumpling for my guy in the parking lot, veggie spring rolls for my guy in the parking lot. So the dude we were talking to in the parking lot, he's vegetarian. Pargo. That's the best one. Sesame rolls and egg the tart. egg tart. We are heading to Rodeo Drive, get the Nespresso, find somewhere to shoot, and go home. I am going to eat my egg tart. Mm, mm, mm -hmm. That's him right there. Mm, mm, mm. Oh my god. Mm, mm. I haven't had that in a very long time. One of my favorite thing about the Tesla is that I can watch YouTube here. I like this guy. This is the guy I was listening to earlier. Fail big. Fail big. Today is the beginning of the rest of your life and it can be, it's good to be very frightening. It, it's a new world out there. It's a mean world out there. You only live once. So do what you feel passionate about. I've been tuning in with him for a long time, but I did stop for a long time. And now I'm back into watching his video again. And there's this particular video that really made me want to go back to watching his video. The burnout of being a content creator. I feel it. Like everything that he talked about there is literally what my mind is telling me. Let me tell you, the burnout feeling and just being a creator in general, just putting yourself out there every single day. When you finally have the chance to step back and look at your life, you kind of just like, yo you need to slow down and really nurture every decision that you do post out there i kid you not that message was like a wake-up call for me and this is why i'm heading back into filming documenting my life again because i don't want to have to look back and be like yo like what happened in 2023 time to location scout this is one of my favorite thing to do is to really just look around the area and feel the vibe and make sure there's no weirdos out there that will be stealing your cameras and just want to mess with you make sure it's not raining make sure it's the right location that we're looking for Maybe we go over there. I had a mood board with two photos on there talking about this is how I want it to look like. Which one? Hey, are you getting up? We just got back. Time to change another outfit. Technically, the ones that I'm already done shooting, I am just put them away. And what I do with the leftover clothes that I have, I just donate them, give it to my family members, either in the Philippines, my family in Reno, or my sister's-in-law that lives in Riverside right now because they go to school out here. The next fit that I have in mind since I'm going to be indoor, I have another tracksuit. Ikea! So it's another light. So it's either I wear a beanie, this. Now let's set up the light. This is the NAND light. It is softbox 80. This is the lantern. We got the NAND light FS 300B right here. Light stand that we got from Sammy. Let's go ahead and turn this on. And we're about to do an unboxing video. I have the LV bag right here. This is the speedy bag that's a collaboration with Pharrell. I'm really excited to open this up. I can't wait for you guys to see it. So we're gonna go ahead and shoot real quick and show you guys everything here is the camera that we're going to be using for the reel this is the canon r6 with a 15 35 millimeter lens from canon and i also have the nd filter this is the tiffin one and this is the 82 millimeter nd filter lens you have to make sure this is locked in Actually, can you take out that little painting that you have on the floor? I think it is time to finally show you what the bag looks like. First of all, shout out to my man for buying this for me. This is definitely one of those bags that I wasn't expecting to get, wasn't planning on getting. Originally, we wanted something else from the collab. This bag was very special. It was definitely one of those things where it's kind of like very spontaneous, like very unexpected. Wasn't planning on getting this, but I am in love. Not only that it's red, not only that it's LV, but the fact that this is Pharrell's collab like 
this is his creation it looks so cute with my outfit now moving on i have another video that i'm doing an unboxing and this one is going to be very interesting that's so cool Big box that was just in my house chill for a minute since Christmas. I didn't think that there was gonna be tons of things in here. So I just wanna give a big shout out to my girl Jordan. Follow each other on Instagram. So this is cool that we both, you know, are doing our own thing. And I love the fact that she collaborated with Nike. This is a big thing, this is huge for her. So really, really proud of her. Guys, you don't understand. I've been wanting this for a long time, but I know it was one of those trends that I'm like, Ugh, I feel like it's just a trend. Like, I don't think I need it. Now it is time to clean up. Okay, 